Hello, this is Molly here, and I'm working on making my Violet Evergarden cosplay. Here are the two dresses and one shirt I'm kind of using as a reference to try to help me get the right. I've got my mannequin, my plans, and fabric. I do need to get some more white. I didn't realize exactly how the dress worked, and so I didn't get enough white. So I need to go get more white, and I'm about to start. So... Let's begin this journey, and there's my computer. I have some pictures of the dress. So we can try to get things worked out. Today, I'm focusing on mostly just the top half of the dress. We'll see if we even finish all of that. Because then, of course, I need the white fabric for this bottom half here. So, again, I uh, hope you enjoy. Let's start the journey. Okay everyone, here's my update video. Um, it's now like almost 4 o'clock. I've spent several hours and I messed up my first one. So, it's take two. I've cut out the fabric and now I'm attaching the sides. Hopefully this one goes better. The last one, I attached all the sides pretty well. And the zipper, and I was just trying it on. I couldn't get it on my model thing, mannequin. So I was trying to put it on myself, and in doing so I ripped the fabric. And so then I tried to sew that up and figure out, like, why, what, what did I do mess up with the zipper? Why could I not get it on the mannequin? And why was it so hard to put on myself? I looked at some other dresses, and then in taking the zipper off, I accidentally ripped more of it. And so I was like, well, um, let's just restart. And I'm going to put the zipper down lower, so I'm going to have to have some buttons and things to actually make sure I can, like, keep it the right amount up, but hopefully moving the zipper down is going to fix it. I thought that the zipper that I had was, like, removable, like I could detach the two sides, but no, I got the wrong zipper. But I'm sure I can still use it. I mean, if I were to sew it in the dress, it wouldn't be able to be detachable anyway. So, I'm going to try to sew the sides together now, and hopefully that works. I think I'm going to sew the sides together, then the top... And then I'll put the zipper on last. And then I'll start working on the sleeves and or neck thing. Okay, thanks. This is the update. Bye for now. Everybody, update. It is the next day, but last night I was able to finish Bodice Part 2 and a collar. And so now I'm going to sew the collar on. Update you. And in the back it is cut like this because and I plan on putting some buttons here. I know it's not perfect, but you know, kind of first try. So just gotta deal with it, I guess. And I'll be wearing a jacket that's like part of the costume, so it'll cover up this back. So I'm pretty sure things are gonna work out fine. Update soon. Bye. Okay, I've finished at least the first part of the sleeves, and then the first part of the skirt. I stopped with the sleeves because I was afraid I was going to run out of fabric, but I think I have enough to finish the sleeves. And, but first, before I do that, I'm going to try to make the back thing. And, or maybe I'll start with doing the button thing here. And then, I'm going to add the brown, and then I'll come back to the sleeves, I think and then finish it with this, and then I'll start working on the blue jacket. So, so far it's okay. It's uh, about to be 5 o'clock. I did take a short break so I could work on a puzzle with my dad. But, now we're doing this again, and things seem to be pretty good. So yeah! Thanks, and... I think actually, before I start in the back, I'm gonna go ahead and do some sewing stuff. I don't know what the word is, but at the bottom, just so it doesn't like break and look all fringy. That's update. It is the next day. I'm really sorry. I had planned to like take pictures and record all this stuff, but then my phone didn't charge and was out of battery and just wasn't cooperating. And so I did, you know, it's a big time skip. So I just wanted to say I used this 
paper thing I made to make these shoulder sleeves and to make this which I still haven't finished showing I've sewn it on kind of so it stays there but there's a lot more to be done to make this though I was really worried especially because I was like uh do I have enough fabric left so what I did was I made this little paper model So like if I would, if I folded this like let me make the bit okay just a second let me fold it and then I'll show you so like yeah this is like half of this square if I fold it like that so it looks like this so then all I have to do is unfold it how do I need to cut my fabric and so that's how I cut my fabric and then I just sewed it kind of inside out so I could flop it over and it would look pretty good. I mean, you still see the brown, which isn't exactly what I wanted, but it looks nice. And now I'm just going to do some touch-ups. I did try the dress on. I'm really happy it fits so far, but I do have to adjust it up here by the collar and a little down here by the zipper just to like, make sure that works out. So after I adjust those, I plan to sew this skirt thing sort of in place and then after that I'll put on the brown ribbon and then after that I think I'll continue with the sleeves and then last I'll make the scarfy thing that's it for now hopefully it won't be that long until I take another picture or something so you won't miss that much bye it's been forever it has been like two hours it's two o'clock I got up there, adjusted a bit, and I managed to get these things to look right-ish, and I attached it to the sides. It's definitely, I don't love it. It took forever, and I kept undoing it and redoing it, but it's, it's good enough. I'm pleased that I was able to finish this part. So next, I'm going to take my brown ribbon, I think. And then after that, I'll start on the weird tie thing and or the army adjustment. Or the sleeves, but they don't, I don't know. Okay, they're sleeves, but I don't want to call them sleeves for some reason. But okay, that's where we are. Yay. Update here, I finished most of the dress and then I was putting on this brown stuff and then I realized I didn't have enough so we quickly ran to the store, bought more brown ribbon along with some other stuff and realized that my blue jacket has a lot of extra things I didn't realize and I did buy one of them being the belt strap thing but then I came home and realized uh, it's like every picture I find for outfit is a little different. So, I mean, I'm going to look at some more pictures from the actual show, but if they do have more of these things, I'm going to have to go to the basement to see if I have any. So now I'm just attaching the brown, and then I'll sew it on. Yay! Okay, so we've finished the main base dress, basically. Once I finish the jacket, I will then maybe finish adjusting the sleeves. I just don't have all that much striped fabric left. And I do need some for the jacket, so it will depend on how much I have left of how the sleeves turn out. But for now, here we are. I am a little disappointed in this part. I am now looking at it and like, oh, why didn't I see? It's supposed to come out here in the front, so... I might just add on, adjust it a little, make my own edit to the dress. But I mean, I'm not going to like undo all this. So I might just have like a third strap, because I do have a little bit of extra. That's where we are now. I'm going to take a quick break, and then we're going to begin work on the jacket. Yay!
we are. I know I haven't been doing videos. I have taken some pictures. Maybe not as many pictures as I had planned. But I finished the jacket. Looking at all the pictures I found on the internet, she does have like several different jackets that look basically the same. But I just went with how her jacket looks in most things. Like the one, the jacket that you can buy on like the internet has some extra like fruffles right here. But I decided to just leave those off because I don't see them in the majority of the show. Also, some of them have a little extra golden thing like right here and right there. And maybe this thing goes up there more. But I decided to just also leave those off. So, now I'm going to just get the other part on the model so I can take some nice pictures. And then I'm going to get all dazzled up and try it on. I'm so happy. And the other one, yes, I had said I might add a little more to the sleeves, but I don't have enough fabric and so won't. But I'm like, I really can't find any pictures of her on the show wearing that outfit without the jacket, so I don't think it matters all that much. Okay, update soon. And here's the finished dress. I think you can tell there are a couple things I maybe messed up and as I said I might go back later and fix this or just add another bit so it looks a little better. And when I bought the fabric I didn't realize that some of it was white and not this stripe but I'm really happy with how it came out especially the back. Like I'm gonna go get... <laughs> 